Bananas in pyjamas are coming down the stairs. Bananas in pyjamas are coming down in pairs. Bananas in pyjamas are chasing teddy bears. Cause on Tuesdays they will try to catch them on the way. Good morning, Mr. Sun. What a beautiful day. A perfect day to go out and play. Oh, no. My clock. Good morning, Morgan. You've broken your alarm clock. Don't worry, Amy will fix it. Never mind, Morgan. You didn't mean to break it. It was just bad luck. I suppose so. What a great day, B2. The best, B1. What should we do today? Hmm. Hey, Bananas! Hello, Morgan! Do you want to play softball with me? Softball? We love softball! It's banana-tastic! You throw, I'll bat. And I'll catch the ball when you hit it. Then I hope you got long arms. Why's that? Because I'm going to hit it high right over the house. Here it comes, Morgan. My super-swerving banana ball. I got it! I've got it! I didn't get it. Oh, no, the window. Morgan! I didn't mean it. Uh, that's fixed it till Charlie can come around and put in a new window. I'm sorry, Amy. Don't worry, Morgan. It was just a bit of bad luck. Bad luck again? Bad luck can happen to anyone. But why does it keep happening to me? It was an accident. That's all. Well, I'm going to make it up to you. Who wants an ice cream from Rat's shop? Yes, please. Thanks again for the ice creams, Rat. Oh, my pleasure, Morgan. Enjoy the cheese and chocolate flavour. Now, I'm off for a ride on my new bike. Here you are, everybody. Ice creams all round. Look out for those plants. A plant? <laughs> Sorry, Amy. Why don't you look where you're going? Oh, don't be upset with Morgan, Amy. It's just bad luck. Even more bad luck. More bad luck. Nothing's gone right for Morgan this morning. He broke his clock, then the window. Now Amy's got ice cream all <sighs> over her. <laughs> it sounds like Morgan is a real bad luck bear. A bad luck bear? Oh, Rat's right. That's what I must be. A bad luck bear. Morgan, come back. Rat didn't mean that. It was just an accident. Don't worry, Teddies. We'll talk to Morgan. Right, B1? Right, B2. Rat was only joking, Morgan. Besides, there's no such thing as a bad luck bear. Yes, there is. Everything I touch goes wrong. I'm bad luck to be around. Oh, that's not true. We're around you. And there's nothing wrong with our luck. See? Do you hear what I hear, B1? I think I do, B2. It sounds like something buzzing. Buzzing bees! Run, B1! I'm running, B2! <laughs> Into the water! <laughs> See, Bananas? That was all my fault. Your fault? No, it wasn't. It was. I'm a bad luck bear and bad luck follows wherever I go. Poor Morgan. It's not always his fault when things go wrong. 
But if he thinks he's a bad luck bear, then he'll be a bad luck bear. Then we have to stop him thinking that. But how? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's good luck bear time. I knew it. The bananas always come up with a plan. What is it, bananas? We'll give Morgan a lucky charm. A four-leaf clover. But what if it doesn't work? We'll make it work. But we need your help. Here's what you have to do. A four-leaf clover's a great idea, B1. Thank you, B2. But all these clovers have three leaves. See? One, two, three. If only we could make a three-leaf clover into a four-leaf one. We can. We can? With our trusty glue stick. We just stick on an extra leaf. And Morgan will never know the difference. We put a little glue here and stick the extra leaf like so. A four-leaf clover. Do you think this is going to work, B2? We'll soon find out, B1, because there's Morgan now. Hi, Morgan. What are you doing? <sighs> I was building a sandcastle, but the waves washed it away. More bad luck. That's just the tide coming in. No, it's me. I'm a bad luck bear. Not anymore. A four-leaf clover? A lucky four-leaf clover. Keep this with you at all times. And you'll be a good luck bear. Oh, uh, thanks, Bananas. But I don't think it'll make any difference. Give it a chance. Who's for some softball down by the lake? Come on, Morgan. You can play too. All right. I just hope I don't break anything. I hope the teddies are ready for the next part of the plan. The good luck bear plan. Here they come. Ready with the munchy honey cake? Munchy honey cake in position. How do you feel, Morgan? Do you feel lucky with your four-leaf clover? Nothing makes me feel lucky. I'm a bad luck... Hey, what's that? It looks like a munchy honey cake. It is. It is a munchy honey cake. But what's it doing here? It's just waiting for some lucky bear to come along and pick it up. A lucky bear like you, Morgan. The lucky charm clover is working already. Maybe. Next up, the lake. Here they come now. Batter up, Morgan. Hit it as far as you can. That's not such a good idea, Bananas. With my bad luck, I'll probably lose the ball. Never. You're a good luck bear now. OK, I'll try. Here it comes, my supersonic banana ball throw. Oh, see? I told you I'd lose the ball. Huh? How did that happen? This really is your lucky day, Morgan. It must have bounced back off something. I love this plan. Every time Morgan hits the ball into the bushes, we throw another one back out again. Hello, Morgan. Hello, Bananas. How's the softball game? <laughs> You'll never guess what's happened. I've stopped being a bad luck bear. That's great. It's all thanks to the Bananas and their lucky four-leaf clover. Our pleasure, Morgan. My luck's changed. I'm a good luck bear now. Morgan, be careful. I'm okay, but my lucky four-leaf clover. Phew, it's still okay. What? It's not real. The bees! Bees? Ah! Ah! Oh. We're sorry, Morgan. We thought a good luck charm would make you feel good. And make you believe you weren't really a bad luck bear. Thanks for trying to help everyone, but it looks like I'm stuck with bad luck forever. Help! Help! My brakes won't work! Help! Oh, we've got to help Rat. But how? Sorry, you're...
your trick won't work. Not this time. It's not a trick. We had nothing to do with it. Rat really can't stop his bike. <laughs> You're right. Hang on, Rat. I'm coming. Morgan, take the shortcut. Wow! Oh, someone! Thank you, Morgan. What a wonderful stroke of luck that you came along when you did. Do you mean that? I most certainly do. Did you hear that? You really are a, a good, good luck, luck bear. bear. Feel like a game of softball? I learned one thing. When things go wrong, it's not because you're a bad luck bear. Sometimes accidents just happen. Oops! I think we've just caused an accident now. A very big accident. What should we do? Run! <laughs> Tap it again, B2. Up it goes, B1. My turn. Oh, no! Follow that balloon! <laughs> there it is, B2. I've got it, B1. Just in time, B2. Hello, Hello bananas. bananas. Hello, Tolstoy. Hello, Thomasina. That looks a fun game. It is. We call it Balloon Tap. Would you like to play? Sorry, Bananas, but we're off to visit my sister. We'll be back tomorrow. Bye. Bye, Bye Turtles. Let's play, B2. Oh, <laughs> it's getting away again. <laughs> After it. <laughs> <laughs> We've squashed our balloon. It's not the only thing we've squashed. The, the turtle's, turtle's garden. garden. Just look at the poor flowers, B1. All squashed, B2. And we squashed them. We have to plant new flowers. And we have to do it right away. Amy. Amy. We need flowers. Lots of flowers. Would you have any to spare? Any flowers will do. Mm, well, I do have some flowers you could have. Thank you, Amy. These will be perfect. Uh, I didn't mean all of them, Bananas. Uh, bananas? The turtles will love these new flowers. And the new flowers will hide the old squashed flowers. And the turtles won't notice anything different. Oh dear. You can still see lots of the squash flowers. We have to do a better job of hiding them. How? Rocks, B1. Great thinking, B2. Uh... I think these rocks will be too small to hide the squash flowers, B2. I think you're right, B1. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's get some big rocks time! One big rock will do the job of lots of small rocks. One big rock coming up. Ready, steady, live! Oomph! Here's the spot, B2. Right, B1. Ah. pajama -rific. Huh? Oh. Ah. This must have been a dam, B2, that was holding all the water in the turtle's water hole. And, and we, we broke, broke it. it. We'll have to fix the dam. Right. But how? Um. Uh, I know. We broke the dam by taking the big rock. So we have to put the big rock back. Then 
We'll dig lots of mud and pack it all around like a big mud pie. It's, it's digging, digging time! time. <laughs> Lulu! Hello, bananas. We need some shovels. Shovels? Sure. Thank you, Lulu. <laughs> Bye, Lulu. But bananas, what do you need shovels for? <laughs> bananas? <laughs> we'll fix this dam in no time, B2. The water hole will fill up again really soon, B1. The turtles will never know anything's happened. And we won't be in any trouble. Pajama Tastic! Oh. Maybe we need more than mud. Maybe we need more big rocks. Lots of big rocks. But how will we carry them? We need wheelbarrows. Morgan! Hi, Bananas! Can we borrow your wheelbarrows? I was going to... Thanks, Morgan. We won't need them for long. Bye, Bye Morgan! Whoa! <laughs> bananas, why do you need them? <laughs> bananas! This is more like it, B2. We're really getting the job done now, B1. One more load of big rocks should do it. And the dam will be as good as new. We did it, B2. We built a dam, B1. We're, We're the, the dam building bananas. The bananas took all my flowers. And they took two shovels. And two wheelbarrows. What could they be doing? I think we'd better find out. If we know the bananas... And we do... It means trouble! No leaks here, B2. And no leaks here, B1. Oh, no! There is a leak! Make that two leaks. How do we stop the leaks? Plug them. More leaks. More plugging. Leaks everywhere, B2. Keep plugging, B1. All plugged. Are you sure the bananas came this way? I'm positive they're down here somewhere. Wow, look at the turtle's waterhole. It looks great. Teddies? Where are you, bananas? Down here! Oh, no! What are you doing down there, bananas? We're stuck. What happened? We're plugging leaks. There are too many leaks to plug. We have to get you unstuck, bananas. One, two... Oh! Tell us what's happened. Everything that's happened. Yes, Teddies. You squashed some flowers. Then planted new flowers. But in hiding the squashed flowers, you broke the dam? Oh. Oh, oh bananas. The turtles will be so angry with us. They'll come home and see that there's no water in their water hole. They won't be able to live here anymore. Don't worry, Bananas. We'll help fix the dam. You will? Of 
course, bananas. That's what friends are for. More rocks. More, More rocks. rocks. More mud. More mud. We really are the dam building bananas. Don't forget the dam making teddies. Everything is fixed. New flowers and a new dam. But whatever you do, don't tell the turtles what's happened. Why not, bananas? Ah! 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 Bananas, come back. It's OK, bananas. We're not angry. You're not? <laughs> the new dam looks even better than the old one. And the flowers you planted are so pretty. You think so? Really? Thank you all very much indeed. Banana-tastic! <laughs> <laughs> Botheration. I'll never get this thing up. We'll help you put it up. Oh, thank you, Bananas. Helpful as always. How's that, Rat? Hmm, let's see. A, a little to the left. Whoa! Now a fraction to the right. Whoa! A bit this way. Now that. <laughs> there. Perfect. Just a little slip, Rat. We'll get this back up in no time. No, or, or I'll have no more shop left. What's the sign for anyway, Rat? The Jam Jamboree. Jam Jamboree? A competition to find the tastiest jam in Cuddles Town, which I'm sure I'll win with my special cheese and cherry jam. Mmm, sounds delicious. jam -a -rama. Bye, Rat. Rat. Bye, Bananas. Hello, Camembert. Did you hear about the jam jamboree? Hasn't everybody? I'm making blackberry jam. And I'm making strawberry jam. And I'm making mud and pickle jam. Mud, mud and pickle? pickle? Ooh. Oh, just wait till you try it. But who's going to decide which jam is the best? You can't have a jam jamboree without a judge. But who? It has to be someone who loves food. What a delicious apple. It's crisp, it's crunchy, it's perfect. Morgan! Morgan. Huh? What did I do? Uh, congratulations, my boy. You are hereby appointed judge of the Jam Jamboree. That couch looks so uncomfortable. Would you like a cushion to sit on? Thanks, Amy. And a nice, cool drink of water. Don't mind if I do. And a plate of munchy honey cakes. Mmm, yum. So, uh, Morgan, do you think you could vote for our blueberry jam? So we can win the jam jamboree? Sorry, but I can't play favourites, not even for my friends. I'll judge every jam on the day and the tastiest one will win. Huh. Then you won't need these honey cakes or the water or this cushion. Oh, OK. I'll go and play with my boat then. Well, if it isn't my best friend, Morgan. Hi, Charlie. 
Like to taste my pineapple jam? I could fix your broken swing while I'm here. Thanks, Charlie, but I'll judge every jam on the day and the tastiest one will win. Hello, Morgan. Sorry, Bananas, but there's nothing you can do to make me vote for your jam at the Jam Jamboree. We don't want you to vote for our jam. We just want to tell you a storm is coming. Thanks, Bananas, but a little rain doesn't worry me. I'm going to stay here and play. Rain or no rain. The rain is so heavy, Lulu. And poor Morgan's still outside. Morgan! You're soaked to the skin. <laughs> Hello, Amy. How's that lucky bear, Morgan? You'd better come inside and see. Hello, Morgan. Hello, bananas. You sound like you've got a cold. Yeah, yeah I had a terrible cold. And now his nose is all blocked and he can't smell a thing. But what about the jam jamboree? Will you still be all right to judge it? <laughs> Don't worry, Bananas. I'll be fine. Past the tea and past the gums. Look out, Tummy. Here it comes. <laughs> Yuck. What is it? <sighs> Sorry, Morgan. But this soup tastes... <clears throat> tastes okay to me. But what about the smell? I can't smell a thing. Oh, no! Morgan's blocked nose means he can't taste things properly. I can taste things probably. Then let's do a test to make sure. Wear this blindfold so you can't see what you're eating. Huh? Here, Morgan. Can you tell me what this is? <coughs> is it an apple? An apple? Correct! Now, try this, Morgan. Lulu! That's an onion. I know. <laughs> Let's see what he tastes. Is it an apple too? No, it's an onion. An onion? What do you know? It tasted like an apple. Morgan's nose is too blocked. If he can't tell the difference between an apple and an onion, how's he going to taste the jam at the Jam Jamboree? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's clear Morgan's nose time! Are you sure this is a good idea, Bananas? Lots of fresh air is good for colds. Ready, Morgan? Ready, Bananas. OK, Charlie, turn it on! <laughs> Taste this, Morgan! Do you know what it is? Is it an apple? No, it's an onion. Morgan still can't taste anything. Well, there must be something else we can try. There is. It's the only thing left. Stinky soup. I wonder why they call it stinky soup. Oh, hey, you. I don't smell a thing. You're so lucky, because we do. Hello, Teddies. Oh, bananas. What a terrible smell. It's that stinky soup, of course. Lots of smelling garlic and Morgan's football socks. <laughs> Let's hope the smell clears Morgan's nose for good. Nip away, Morgan. I smell nothing. I think my nose is still blocked. Oh, it's no good. There's no way he can judge the jam jamboree. Someone else will have to judge the jam instead. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's jam judging time! This is so exciting. I wonder whose jam will win. We'll soon find out. Here come the judges now. All set to taste some jam, Judge One? Tasting spoon ready, Judge Two. Oh, I wish I could judge the jam jamboree, but my nose is still bogged. Hmm, 
Which jam will we taste first, Judge One? They all look so good, Judge Two. Well, try my cheese and cherry jam first, Bananas. It's the tastiest by far. Sorry, Rat, but ours is best. Try our blueberry. I'm sure they'd rather try my strawberry. No, my mud and pickle is brilliant. But not nearly as nice as my blackberry jam. Which isn't a patch on my pineapple. Here, bananas, take a spoonful. <laughs> no, ours first. No, mine. Wait, don't worry. We'll try them all. Was that the pineapple B2? Hmm. No, that's the cheese and cherry B1. Hang on. I thought this was cheese and cherry. Hmm. No, that was the mud and pickle. I think I've spilt the strawberry. Ah, oh, now it's mixed up with the blackberry. Oh, I think I'm getting mixed up too, B2. We're both mixed up, B1. No, no, no. My jam jamboree is turning into a disaster. Stop! Oh dear! I'll get it! I can smell. That sneeze must have cleared my nose. And I can smell these grapes. Morgan's nose is all better. Now he can judge the jam jamboree. But all the jams are mixed up together. How can he tell which one's the best? OK, Nose, do your job. Hmm. <laughs> well, what do you think? I think if you mix a little bit of this jam with a little bit of that and little bits from all the rest... Here, try it. delicious jam I've ever tasted. Do you see that, B1? Morgan's made the Cuddlestown Fruit Salad Jam, B2. Now everyone's a winner. Yay! Yay! <laughs> now my nose is back to normal, I thought I'd cook some soup to celebrate. Mmm, <gasps> delicious, Morgan. I think it's your best soup ever. <laughs> But there's something a little different. Something extra tasty. I wonder what it could be. I think I know. My football sock. Oh, Morgan! I'm sorry, I didn't mean for that to happen. I wonder what happened to the other one. It's right here. Socks are like bananas, aren't they, B1? Why is that, B2? You should always have two together. Oh, bananas! <laughs> My friends, I'm so happy you've come. Because I want to show you something, something new. What's new? Well, something amazing, that's what. Jellies! Jellies of a new and fabulous flavor. Pajama-rific! Wow! Try it and tell me what you think. But I know what you'll think. That rat is the cleverest of clever rats. Enjoy! Yeah! Mm. What's this flavour, Rat? It tastes like... cheese? You have it! It is cheese jelly! Mm. It's interesting. It's different. It's great! I knew it! <laughs> This is only the beginning of my cheese adventure. Next, I'm going to try cheese-flavoured ice cream. If I can mix cheese and ice cream, I'll have the perfect food. Good luck. You're such a clever rat, rat. <laughs> cheese is so wonderful. If only I could turn everything into cheese. Cheese. Lovely cheese. Cheese. Behold! I am no longer rat in a hat. I am the Prince of Cheese. Now all I need is to learn the magic spell of cheese power. Aha! 
nibbly nobbly nub be cheese Be a book again. Oh, come on. <laughs> Never mind. I'll work on that later. The secrets of cheese are mine. Cuddles Town, get ready to become Cheese Town. I can't wait till everyone sees my new powers. They'll be so thrilled. We've never seen anything like that before. You may bow before the Prince of Cheese. Your princeness? Oh. oh! Why not your cheesiness? Your cheesiness! Mm, no, stick with your princeness. Yes, your princeness. A prince should always have some knights. Would you like to be my knights, Bananas? How do we become your knights? It's very simple, Bananas. Just bow before me again. With the power of this princely scepter of cheese, I pronounce you Sir B1 and Sir B2. Arrive! Hello, Sir B2. Hello, Sir B1. It's not every day I meet a knight. And I've never seen a knight during the day. <laughs> <laughs> Follow me, Sir B1 and Sir B2. I'm not only a prince, but I'm a prince with cheese power. Cheese power? Anything I touch instantly turns into cheese. Well, take these apples. <laughs> now, they are cheese. Ooh. Or this bread. <laughs> it's cheese too. <laughs> these nuts, cheese. And this cheese, uh, oh, it's already cheese. But if it wasn't, I could make it into cheese. It is cheese. All cheese. Amazing. And I don't have to stop at food. Look at this book full of paper. Now it's a book full of cheese slices. And why just sit on a chair? When you can sit on a chair and eat it too. But Prince Rat, I don't want to eat my favorite chair. Or just watch how these pretty flowers can be even prettier. See? All cheese. I don't think cheese flowers are very pretty. And they don't smell like flowers anymore. They smell like cheese. Will my magic powers work on something as big as a house? Oh, there's only one way to find out. House be cheese. <laughs> need to thank me, Banana Knights. Just enjoy your house of cheese. <coughs> A home to nibble on. Brilliant. We like eating cheese, but we don't want to live in cheese. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. We have to ask Rat to stop. It's, it's no more cheese time. <laughs> <laughs> Well, the bananas shouldn't be the only ones with a home of cheese. The teddy should have one too. House B Cheese. Our home? What happened to it? <laughs> it's all thanks to me, Rat, the Prince of Cheese. Prince of Cheese? You lucky teddies. I've turned your home into cheese. Have a taste. <laughs> It is cheese! Rat, you have to stop! What else has he done? Our home is cheese too! And all our food is cheese! And our furniture is cheese! Even our flowers are cheese! The whole world will be cheese! Rat, you mustn't do that! Why not? Because, well, who wants everything to be cheese? I do! But the whole world can't be cheese! Yes, it can. And I, Rat the Prince of Cheese, will make it so. <laughs> oh, dear. What can we do? And now, what I've always wanted, a shop full of cheese and made of cheese. Shop, be cheese, be nothing but cheese. Stop, Rat. We don't want the world to be cheese. We just want cheese to be cheese. As your friends, Rat, we want you to stop. But don't you see, Teddies? 
I'm doing this because you're my friends. I want you all to share my wonderful world of cheese. <gasps> Rats! What did you do to Amy and Morgan? I don't know. Why don't they talk? Why don't they move? Oh, no. They're cheese. You made them cheese, Rat? But, but, but... Uh, I didn't mean to, Lulu. Amy, Morgan, please don't be cheese. Stop being cheese. You have to turn them back into teddies. Quickly, Rat. Yes, yes, of course. Um, but I can't. I can only turn things into cheese. I can't turn them back. Oh, cheese and whiskers. There, there, Rat. We'll work something out. <laughs> Lulu? Lulu's turned into cheese too. We have to get away from here. Quickly! <laughs> Bananas, wait! Oh, come back! I didn't mean to do it! Oh, dear! Oh, what have I done? Oh, cheese and whiskers! What am I going to do? Friends! I want my friends! What? What's happened? A dream! Oh, it was only a dream! I'd better check to be sure. <laughs> oh, it's wood. Which means it's not cheese. <laughs> oh, tin. <laughs> Paper. <laughs> uh, uh, flowers. Not cheese flowers, but real flowers. Hello, rat. Oh, bananas. Do you still like me? Of course we like you. And the teddies? Do they still like me too? We're sure they do. You can ask them yourself. Morning, Rat! Oh, teddies! You're not cheese! Uh, why would we be cheese, Rat? Sorry, Amy, would you mind? <laughs> that tickles, Rat! It was a dream! Oh, how wonderful! I didn't really turn you into cheese after all. Cheese? Why would you turn the teddies into cheese, Rat? Because I was too greedy, Bananas. Too greedy for cheese. What a lovely day and not a piece of cheese in sight. It's such a nice day that we made fresh fruit jelly. And we're all here to invite you over to have some. Oh, jelly? Oh, I'd love some jelly. There's no cheese in it, is there? None at all. Then I'll have some. But only a little. Sometimes you can have too much of a good thing. Come on, everyone. Let's be on our way. Uh, is it just me? Or does Rat seem a bit funny today? Rat's always a little bit funny, B2. Oh, oh that rat in the hat. <laughs> <laughs> day for a walk, B1. A very fine day for a walk, B2. Oh, cheese and whiskers. Oh, there's so much mail to deliver. I'll never finish it. Look out, Rat. <laughs> oh! It's okay, Rat. We'll help you. <laughs> oh. Oh. Dear, oh dear. Just look at this mess. Don't worry, Rat. We'll help clean it up. Oh, woe is me. What's wrong, Rat? Oh, there's so much to do, Bananas. How am I ever going to deliver all this mail on time? Hmm. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's Rat's car time! It is? You can use your car to deliver the mail. 
Of course I can. What a splendid idea. Oh, I'm so clever to think of it. Let's load up the car. Oh, thank you, Bananas. Now, stand back now. Are you sure you can see where you're going? Uh, maybe you should deliver the mail in two trips. Uh, two trips? I'm far too busy for that. Uh, bye, Bananas! Will Rat be all right, B1? Maybe we'd better follow him, just to be sure, B2. Thank you, Bernard. But now how will I deliver the mail? It's OK, Rat. We'll get your car out of the ditch. You should look where you're going, Rat. You nearly ran us over. You really should be more careful. Me? But this was all your fault. What? I can't deliver the mail if you all keep crossing the road willy-nilly in front of me. But, Rat... It's time Cunnelstown had some proper road rules. Road rules? Correct. And the sooner the better. Right, Bananas, it's time for action. Follow me. What are the brushes and paint for, Rat? Cuddlestown is about to get a proper crossing. What's that, Rat? Well, the place where everyone must cross the road. The only place they cross the road. The only place? Exactly. And you're the ones to do this important job, Bananas. So, let's get to work. Right, Rat. Now, Bananas, I want you to paint some stripes. What sort of stripes, Rat? Um, like the stripes on your pyjamas. Mm, if you say so, Rat. Come on, B1. Let's paint our stripes. Stop! You don't paint each other. We don't. No, you paint the stripes on the road. Oh, that's a much better idea. One stripe, two stripes. Very good, Bananas. Now paint two more. One more stripe, two more stripes. Perfect. Now everyone will know where to cross the road. But how will they know when to cross? That's where you come in, Bananas. You will be our very own Cuddlestown traffic monitors. Traffic monitors? It will be your job to tell everyone when it's safe to cross the road. But we don't know anything about being traffic monitors. Oh, it's very easy, Bananas. Now off you go to Charlie's. He's made some lovely signs for you to carry and he'll show you how to use them. Yes, yes rat. rat. Congratulations on your new job, Bananas. Being traffic monitors is a very important position. Thanks, Charlie, but we don't really know what to do. It's easy, Bananas. You just hold up the signs. Red means stop and green means go. Red means stop and green means go. <laughs> Excellent. And to show everyone who you are, here are your new traffic monitor caps. Banana-tastic! Come on, B1. Traffic crossing, here we come. Hup, 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 hup. We'd better hurry, Traffic Monitor One. Rat will be delivering the mail soon. Look, there are the teddies. And they're trying to cross the road themselves. Stop! Why do we have to stop, Bananas? Because we're the Traffic Monitors. You can only cross when we hold up our signs. Red means stop and green means go. And we're holding up our red signs, see? If you say so, Bananas. But how long do we have to stop here? Just till after Rat comes past in his car. Ah, oh, that's good, because here he comes now. 
morning, Rat. Hello, B1. Uh, what seems to be the problem? Problem? I don't see a problem. Then why have you stopped us all? Have we? That's right. We're waiting for Rat. And Rat's waiting for us. Oh, no, B2. Our traffic signs must be broken. Oh, you funny bananas. They're not broken. They're not? No. We stop because you're showing us a red sign. And I've stopped because you're showing me a red sign too. <laughs> Turn our signs around, B1. <laughs> That's better. Thanks, bananas. Whiskers. Well, my car won't stop. Help! Oh, someone! Hurry, traffic monitor one. We have to help Rat stop his car. Hurry, bananas. He's heading for our house. Look out! Or stand clear out of my way. Huh? Rat! <laughs> Sorry, Morgan. Morgan, we need your help. Which way did Rat go? Towards Camembert's barn. Thanks. Let's get after him, Traffic Monitor 2. Right, Traffic Monitor 1. <laughs> Morning, Rat. Do you have any mail? Out of the way, Cameron Bear. Can't stop. Oh! Oh, honestly, Rat and his car are becoming a serious menace. Cameron Bear. <laughs> Which way did Rat go? He's heading for Pedro's pen. Thanks! <laughs> Pedro, look out! <laughs> dear, oh dear. Uh, Pedro, tell Charlie to bring the tractor so he can pull my car out of the mud. On my way, rat! <laughs> At last! Oh. It stopped. Oh, bananas. How wonderful that you're here. Is it? Obviously, with my car stuck in this mud, I can't deliver the mail. So you'll have to do it for me. But we can't. We have to be traffic monitors at the crossing. Nonsense. You only need to do that if there's a car coming. And seeing as the only car in Cuddlestown is stuck here in the mud, you're free to visit everyone's letterbox. Do we have to? Of course, Bananas. Remember, the mail must always get through. Oh. We did it, Rat. <laughs> we delivered all the mail. Excellent. Oh. Well, my new crossing has been such a success. I'm going to deliver the mail by car every day. You will? Congratulations, Bananas. It looks like you both have full-time jobs as traffic monitors. Oh. I think I need a rest, Traffic Monitor 1. I definitely need a rest, Traffic Monitor 2. Oh. Oh. You poor bananas. You're worn out from chasing Rat's car all over Cuddlestown. And delivering the mail as well. And now we have to be Traffic Monitors too. Why do we need a crossing on Cuddlestown Avenue anyway? Because we never know when Rat's car will come along. What a pity he couldn't warn us somehow. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's, it's a new horn for Rat's car time! <laughs> now everyone will know when you're coming. And that's not all, Rat. Look! Now you can put all your mail in this special trailer. And that means you can always drive safely. But what about the traffic monitor bananas? With my new trailer and tooting horn, they'll be out of a job. Actually, we love not being traffic monitors. Really? Well, in that case, I'll be off. The mail waits for no rat. <laughs> Sounds like music, B2. Yeah! It's got a beat to make you move your feet. Hup, 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 hup. And move your arms too, like this. 
Woo! Woo! Spin it around, B1! I'm spinning, B2! Whoa! <laughs> Oof! pajama -tastic. I wonder where that music's coming from! It sounds like... The, the Teddy's, Teddy's House! After you, B2! After you, B1! Thank you! <laughs> After you again, B2! Right, B1! Look! It's Morgan! Great music, Morgan! I don't think he can hear it, B1! That's because he's got his headphones on, B2. I'm a teddy bear DJ, that's my game. DJ Morgan, that's my name. Oh. Hello, Morgan! <laughs> Sorry, Morgan. What are you doing? I'm the DJ at Camembert's birthday party. banana -rific. Uh, what exactly is a DJ, Morgan? It means I play the music and bust some moves. Wow! And I'm going to do my DJ teddy bear rap sound and light show spectacular. I'll show you. First I turn on the DJ microphone. Then all the extra speakers. And finally my awesome light show spectacular. Ah, I don't understand what's happening. Hang on. Uh-oh. Now to mix our cake for Camembert's birthday. Huh? That's weird. The mixer worked fine before. Perfect. These fairy lights will really brighten up my party. Oh. Well, I never. Oh, cheese flavoured ice creams. Just the thing for Camembert's birthday. Oh, cheese and whiskers. My freezer stopped working. Charlie! What do you mean there's no power? What? No electricity anywhere? Please, everyone, the good news is that I've worked out what's gone wrong. Splendid! But what's the bad news, Charlie? <laughs> the bad news is that Morgan had too many things turned on and the Cuddlestown power station is broken. Oh. But the very good news is that I know how to fix it. Marvellous. Hopefully there's no other very bad news, Charlie. Unfortunately, there is, Lulu. What is it? The very bad news is that it will take me many hours. Oh. <laughs> but what about my party? I need power for the party lights. And we need power to bake the birthday cake. Oh, this is all my fault. I'm really sorry, everyone. Don't worry, Morgan. The whole night will be ruined for everyone. Never fear. Charlie is here. If anyone can fix it, he can. There's absolutely nothing to worry about. Oh, except the ice creams. Ice creams? If we don't have power, the freezer won't stay cold. And you know what that means? What? Well, the ice creams are going to melt! Melted ice cream? Emergency! <laughs> Emergency! <laughs> we need a plan to keep them cold. Now think, bananas, think. <laughs> are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. We need ice! It's, it's let's, let's visit, visit Charlie time! You're in luck, bananas. You got the last two bags of ice in the cold room. <laughs> Thanks, Charlie. The, this ice is certainly c c cold. Da, 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 very cold. Let's, let's get them back to rat. <laughs> Excellent. This will keep the ice creams perfectly frozen. Top job, bananas. For cheese and whiskers. Morgan! Quick, Rat, let's get him in the sun so he can warm up. Now let's get B1. Uh, couldn't we uh, oh, have a little rest for a minute? Later, Rat, come on. Oh, honestly, the things I do for those bananas. Are you carrying him, Rat? Oh, you can rely on me, Morgan. B2, are you all right? Have you warmed up yet? Back to normal, Morgan. Now I know what a snowman feels like. Phew, that ice was cold. Is the power back on yet? No, Charlie's still working on it. And Amy and Lulu still need to make a cake for the party. 
Then what are we waiting for? Let's go and help! If Charlie doesn't get the power fixed soon, we'll never get this cake cooked in time. Amy, Lulu, we're here to help! Thanks, Bananas, but if there's no power, then the oven doesn't work. And if the oven doesn't work, then we can't cook the cake. So there'll be nothing to eat at Camembert's party. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's fruit salad time! Fruit salad? With plums and pears and apples and oranges. What a great idea, Bananas. Let's start picking. We are the teddies and the bananas. We're always ready. Pajama roll. We are the teddies and the bananas. We're always ready. Pajama roll. We are the te te teddies and the bun nun 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 nun. Look at all this fantastic fruit. Thanks, bananas. Our pleasure. A birthday fruit salad. What could be better? It's not a fruit salad yet. We have to make it now. Then let's get cracking. We should go and see Camembert, B2, and see if she needs any help. <sighs> Happy birthday, Camembert. Ready to have a great party? I don't think so, Bananas. What's wrong? We've got your party ice creams all frozen in Rat's freezer. <laughs> and we've picked all the fruit for your special birthday fruit salad. Yum! So... What's the problem? I don't want to seem ungrateful, Bananas, but there's still one thing missing. What's that? With no power, my party lights won't work. It's going to be a very, very dull party without decorations. Decorations? Lights! Colour? I know. We could cut up some coloured paper and make streamers. And we can do some coloured paintings for the walls. Let's go! Leave it to us, Camembert. It's no good, Bananas! Why not, Camembert? If we don't have any lights, no one will be able to see the streamers or paintings anyway. You'll just be wasting your time. Oh. But thanks for the thought, Bananas. It's very kind of you. Did you see that, B2? See what, B1? That! I do see it, B1! Look, Camembert! The coloured lights! <laughs> That's because the power's back on! You mean you fixed it? What a clever Charlie you are! That means everything will be ready to go! Just in time for the party! banana Rivik! <laughs> Marvellous party, Camembert! Oh, fabulous ice creams, Rat! Oh, I had to work so hard to keep them cold, you know. But, as always, I rose to the challenge. Ahem! Oh, uh, <coughs> with the bananas' help, of course. And now we got power, it's time to play some music with me, DJ Morgan. Oh, I can't wait! Everybody, get ready to dance! But remember what happened last time, Morgan. Don't have too many things turned on at once. Don't worry, I won't make that mistake again. Stand by, everyone, for the birthday wrap. We'll help, DJ Morgan. We'll get everything ready for you. Thanks, Bananas. Uh, everything? First, we'll turn on Morgan's microphone. Then his t -t -t turntable and all the speakers. And finally, his light show spectacular. No, Bananas, not all at once. Oh, no, not again. Oh. Oops. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> I can fix it, but it will take a while. Oh, no, there's no power to play the music. How can I do my birthday rap without it? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's making music time. Let's all grab some things we can use to make music. Like sticks to tap together. Or tins we can play. Like drums. Or anything that shakes and rattles. Ready? One, two, three, four. OK, Morgan, take it away. I'm DJ Morgan, hip, hip, hooray. And I'll spin my discs on your birthday. So happy birthday, Cam and Bear, from DJ Morgan, the DJ Bear. Hooray!
We're the bananas and we agree that parties are fun for our whole family. Yay! Two, three.